It really is uh, a worldwide phenomenon, the idea that a simpler way is a better way. It is incredible how it isn't just a business thing now, it is a personal thing. In fact, when I wrote my first book, I actually didn't think of it as a business book, to be honest. It was inspired by my experience with Steve Jobs and Apple, but I thought it had applications in real life. You can look at sort of the, the trends in civilization. I mean, it, it, we look back at things we did 30 years ago and we can't believe that, that we ever thought that was good, right? Because I think civilization as a whole sort of, you know, we, we grow together. Um, early commercials I did, by the way, that won awards for their fantastic acting and, and casting are laughable by today's standards, and I wonder why we ever won awards. Um, but I think it's because, again, society as a whole sort of gets more sophisticated over time. And I think as part of this uh, evolution of society, we are more conscious as we see more products that are beautifully designed um, doing so well. People didn't used to ask for that. I think now more people demand it. Um, and companies see what people are demanding and they start making things that way. So I do believe that there is this overall trend towards simplification that more, more businesses understand the power of it. There's an awful lot of money to be made there. And uh, as I said, customers are demanding it. So I would love to see the world in another 100 years or so. I think we're gonna live in a far simpler place. But for anyone who worries that if you become a, a champion of simplicity that you're just gonna become one of the herd, don't worry about that because I think um, the way human evolution works, it's all in our heads and I think, uh, I think we're good for a few thousand years. I believe simplicity will, will continue to stand out for many, many years to come.